coming off fingers. I'm well, sorry. why isn't it sucking? But no more. Mmm, it like amps me up. Wow. <laughs> oh, that looks fine. Hey guys, we're back and it is finally time for part three of transforming this place into a place that I actually like to come home to. Now, before we get into it, let's go back and take a look of how far we have come. This is what our apartment looked like only two months ago. It is insane looking back how different it looks, but man, did I hate coming home to our place. Our furniture just made no sense in the spots that they were in. We didn't have the proper storage and this place just felt bare. It didn't feel like our home. All right, now that we've all seen how far we've come, let's just get straight into it and finish this place up. We are finally gonna be tackling the entryway because it is so cluttered and just such a disaster. I could not be happier. My friend is finally letting us use his truck to move this giant box. For a year and a half, this stupid box has been here, but no more. I also got this little entryway thing off of Facebook Marketplace for just 20 bucks. So we're gonna hang out on these two random nails that are just already in the wall. Perfect. It looks so cute. So we are improving our bathroom because it is not looking good. We just had dinner and of course it is the perfect time to fix up the bathroom. Yes! Improvements. Installation steps. Look at this shit. Gross. You're, gonna, you're gonna slip. Gross. This first. I don't think I'm putting this the right way. What do you mean? There's like a suction side and non-suction well, side. Well, why isn't it sucking? Oh, babe, we forgot about the wine. To 800 subscribers. Yay! Now it's like when you take a shower, you can see each other. Exactly. <laughs> I love it. Alright, let's see how see-through it is. I can see you completely. <laughs> I'm the only one back. Now it is time to make this clutter organized by shoving it in the corner. First one is ready for installation. So where's a good spot? Hey, where'd you put the small one? Here and here. No, that's too high. Maybe here and here. That feels like good height. Right? She yes. has. Take a sip. I'm nervous. Stick her real good. <clears throat> okay, round two. It's not that baby. Look at that. Beautiful. You know, fucking, fucking. Yeah. Okay, now put, put stuff on it. See? Yeah? Do you have to like wait 24 hours? Yeah, fuck it. 24 hours? For what? To make sure it sticks. Why? Because of this up. Nasty. It looks pretty good. It's just clean enough like nothing ever happened. La -di -da. Why is it pink in this corner? What does pink mean? Wow. This is looking fancy. Wow, our bathroom looks so clean now. Damn. Putting things up on a shelf just like... Wow. So next on the list of upgrades, we are doing something pretty random. <laughs> so I got these adorable little like um what are these called oh my god literally what are these called okay so i've apparently forgotten the word for this but we are gonna replace those ugly little brown wooden ones with these gorgeous blue flower ones from anthropology that i got on facebook marketplace honestly i just get so proud of myself when i find something that just fits perfectly in my home on facebook marketplace for like a fraction of the cost it just like mm, it like amps me up makes me feel so good <laughs> I guess I don't actually know if these fit. I'm just really hoping they will because it just seems to be like a generic little screw, right? Oh, it fits. Aww, they look so cute. Okay, they might be a little big, but they are freaking adorable. <laughs> Today, I think I also want to change up the pictures around the bar cart. Now that we've kind of switched up the table and the bar cart, it just kind of feels like these photos don't really belong there. Like maybe I could do four here, like two and two or just the four. And then 
I bought this print on Etsy, so I'm thinking of printing it out in like a big poster size and then just putting it right in front of the bar cart, like right there. And then adding some kind of pink accents because we've already got this little bit of pink. Maybe I can like add instead of this, like some kind of pink thing and bring it all together. I think that'd be nice. And then you've got the disco message right beside the disco bullshit. I feel like it's it's coming together. I seriously just love this print. This girl wins a killa, baby. Hi, um, I was hoping to get like a poster sized image printed. Awesome. How do I do that? <laughs> okay, so apparently it is better to go get the frame that you want and then match the poster size to the frame. Otherwise, you're gonna have so much trouble getting a frame. So, we're going to Michael's first, then we're gonna print the poster. Nice. I think we're gonna get one of these. Okay, I mean, I was going for that size, but apparently this is the size that Etsy says it'll print. So I guess we gotta get this one. All right, now back to UPS we go. Hi, oh, you were bringing this thing for the poster, yeah. <laughs> All right, you ready for the grand reveal? Isn't that fucking gorgeous? Oh my God, can't see shit because the reflection. Oh, beautiful. So good. Okay, now obviously we have to hang it, but I also have to move those. So I think we're gonna leave that for another day. But it looks so good. Today is the day that we are taking down these pictures that I literally just put up because this guy is gonna be so much cuter. We're gonna be putting up a lot of pictures today, which is perfect because I just found this giant Ziploc bag full of what are these? Picture hanging command the hooks? Yeah, so we have like a million now, so we're set. This makes me so sad. It's okay, babies, I will just be relocating you. All right, starting from scratch. <clears throat> so first things first is this guy. so much nicer as my purse hooks. Maybe we'll switch them up. We'll see how I feel. All right, we found the winner. Bam. Yeah, we definitely need something taller here. Look at that. It's cute. A little tiny, but it's cute. Smush. Smush. Time for the other side now. So we're going to use this funky little guy for these ones this time. Not the wrong ones that poke out. Stop moving! No! Fuck! Look how off they are. <laughs> okay, so I lied. We're now switching to. Oh, that one. <sighs> We're now switching to these command hooks because I'm not liking how these are sitting and they're so uneven. <sighs> that took way too long. It is what it is. I'm not loving it. I need I need more things over there. I think maybe that's what it is. And I still haven't figured out what's going up there. But this is it for now. Okay, now this is going to be the seriously hard part where I have to put up all of these photos on this wall and figure out the best way to organize them. So I love this one. Let's do this one lower. We have to spread these two out. You guys know when you have an ugly thermostat that you just want to hide? You get a canvas print and... Wow. <laughs> okay, now I need to do wow. the whole wall around this canvas print. All right, we're completely changing it all now. I think we have decided on this mishmash. Now is the fun part. Gorgeous. Luna vs. Fly. Okay, well, he clearly didn't get it. He loses it after like three oh. seconds. Luna, be useful. All right. All right, how are we looking so far? Slowly adding pieces. I forgot to tell you guys, since uh, wallpapering this wall is literally $700, we are not doing it. We're just gonna put it off until either I can afford it or I decide to paint it or just do something different. So that's why we're just putting them all up. This is what the mango is supposed to taste like. Okay. 
okay? Not like this grocery store bought mango that. So where do you get this? Your mom went and picked it in the Philippines? No, it's from the Asian supermarket. So it's still from the grocery store? Yeah, but not the regular one. Oh, my no bad. <laughs> That'll be the one that falls on my face at night. <laughs> so I fucked up the design already. So now we're just winging it and hoping for the best. Fuck, I think I put the thing crooked. Please be straight. Please, please, please be straight. Fuck, it's still crooked. All right, we're gonna have to pause for today because I do not have enough of the proper command hooks that I need. For some reason, I have like a thousand command hooks that are for canvases. I think I was just using those and I didn't realize before, but it is not gonna work above our bed because they are gonna fall on us for sure. To be continued. Okay, Steven had this idea to do some like squiggle decal kind of through there because I feel like it's like, I don't know, it's kind of off, like it's not finished. And honestly, I think it's a great idea. So part four it is. We are finally putting the final touches on the bathroom. Our shower is one of those super long showers. So you can't just get a regular shower curtain for it. So I've kind of struggled to find one that I like. But honestly, I think my standards are just too high and I kept looking for something that would be perfect. When in reality, this blue $30 shower curtain from Amazon is fine. Plus it matches the garbage can, so it is good enough. Oh, and it came with these fancy little, little, those things, you know, that it hangs from. I didn't even realize. I think we're gonna switch them out because I hate those ones. The shower curtain constantly comes out of it, as you can see. <laughs> Let's put her together. Whew. This curtain is heavy. Nice. Looking good. And those like metal hangers make it roll so much easier than the plastic ones did. <laughs> I also went to the store today and I bought more of the command hooks that are the actual ones that I need for all of these photos. So we're finishing the photo wall. I have been putting this off for so long. Let's just get it done. I think I would say we're past halfway. So, you know, this is gonna be quick. It's gonna be fine. This one is coming down. I can't, this is not, the right command hook. Let's replace that baby. All right, now the fun part. All right, so I can't reach the top. Luna, oh my God. <sighs> She's done. This is the best we have got. And now we have one picture left over that didn't fit because I could not reach the top of that wall. I was way too hopeful. So maybe it'll fit there, maybe. All right, let's cross our fingers and hope that it sits nicely there. Send out fingers. That looks terrible. I need to fix that shelf. Oh. So like about to fall off. I know, that's what it looks like. Can you help me push? Like the front of it, just push. Let's try it again. Okay, it looks better. I'm not minding it, but I need to add like a small picture beside it or something. I think I know what I'm gonna do. I got the picture. All right, now let's see how it looks. Will the vision come together? Oh yeah, looks so good. Okay, I have also decided that I cannot take how plain and boring this bar card is. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna spray paint this. Like looking at the spray paint bottle that I used, it says that it's fine for metal. I know that's probably like black painted metal, but I don't know, it's probably fine, right? So I think the hard part about spray painting this is trying not to get one of those hairs because they are everywhere. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna hold the plate, like hold it and just spray. And wow, my hand is not protected. Oh well, it's fine, it'll wash off. Oh my God, straight on my hand. I'm gonna let it relax for like 10 minutes and then go over it again. And hopefully it'll be done. Somebody misses us. Oh. <laughs> coat one is looking pretty good. I think we might be good with two coats. Oh, the bottom looks fine. Who needs the bottom done? You're gonna do a disclaimer, right? Like if you ever attempt this, I do suggest wearing a respirator. That was so much better than the first time we tried to spray paint something out here. 
okay i think it's time we switch out these purse hooks i didn't even have matching hooks so i literally have one clear one and one white one but i found these ones so now we have some fancy purse hooks oh wonderful it broke oh my god they're all ripping what the fuck so i've never had this happen where every single command hook as you're pulling it to get it off the wall it just rips so i have nothing to pull it off the wall so we're just gonna have to pry it off i don't know and hope the paint doesn't come off one down all right we got her we got them off all right good as new now this time i want to make sure i actually have enough space for my purses because the other time this was like hanging in my laundry so let's actually <laughs> kind of measure it like that looks so much better now we've got the longer purses Let's see. Now the final purse. All right. Now the moment of truth. <gasps> it fell. All right. We've got one. We've got two. We've got three. You guys, will it stay? Will it stay? We've got four. When you have small spaces, it is all about using what you have. And all we have for our purses is wall space. <laughs> all right. It is finally time for the grand reveal. So the entryway has been cleaned up. It's looking so much better and this little cabinet is so freaking useful. Now on to the rest of the place. Right away, there are so many fun colors and it looks so much more open and welcoming. Then we have these purse hooks that are so freaking useful. The bathroom feels like a hotel bathroom. It just feels so much more spacious and clean. I even organized this cabinet a little differently so it looks a little less cluttered and those little llamas are so cute. The picture wall makes such a difference above the bed. I feel like our home is finally coming together. We've got our gorgeous windows and then the piece de resistance. The sunglass shelf looks amazing. I'm loving the photos we did on it. The bar cart is coming together. And honestly, I think a little squiggle detail on that wall will really bring together the bar cart and dining room. I just feel like this setup fits so much better and it really just elevates our place. It feels so much more high end. I still have to figure out the best way to decorate it, but I think for now, this is doing it. It is insane what I have been able to accomplish with this place in just six freaking weeks. Some of these changes are just so simple. Like just hanging all of my pictures that I have been putting off for a year and a half and then spray painting a tray pink because I had the spray paint left over and I needed a pop of color. Putting up shelves in the bathroom just to take all the clutter off the bathtub. Printing out some pictures and framing them and just making spots for things in my home so that it doesn't look cluttered. Honestly, this mirror bar cart area is my new favorite spot in the house. I just love it so much. And those little peaches, those little peaches, I can't, like it's just so freaking cute. Sure, there's always gonna be little improvements I'm working on, little things I wanna do, but overall, I'm just so happy with our space. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for following along on this journey. It has been so much freaking fun. If you enjoyed, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you guys at the next one. Love you!